Hey guys, welcome back. Today Vlogmas is still going on. It's the holiday season, which we all know, right? Today, you guys, y'all know, if you're new here, just, just know, I love red lipstick. Like, love it. I mean, literally, I can wear red lipstick every single day. And we'll try to, right? The last time I looked at my vanity, which was just the other day, and I took out all my lipsticks just on my vanity, um, and what I could see, I had 32 red lipsticks in different formulas, liquid, gloss, dark red, bright red, orange red, I had 32. That's how much I love red lipstick, right? So, for the holidays, I kind of like to do a little roundup of some of my favorite things. And today, out of those lipsticks, I had to pick five of them that I would rank in my top five for the holiday season. The lipsticks that look great, they are universally flattering. Some of them are liquid, some of them are cream, but these are my top five of all time. And it's hard to say that, right? It's so hard because I have so many and I love them all, but I picked five that I absolutely love and I think will be perfect for the holiday season. And I'm gonna show you all five of these lipsticks. So I hope that you will keep watching. Okay, y'all, like I said, it was very hard to narrow this down to just five lipsticks, but I did it miraculously. So we're going to go from five to one. Now, if you're not new here and you've been rolling with me since I started this channel in 2019, you'll know that my very first video was my top five red lipsticks for dark skin, right? I haven't done anything like this since 2019 and I went back and watched that video and I was like, girl, <laughs> I've come a long way. Thank God. But I was like, you know what? I did do that, but it's been a couple years, so I'm going to do it again. So let's go. Number five on my list is from MAC Cosmetics. It is Ruby Woo, but it is from MAC Cosmetics' new release that they did in the fall called The Ruby's Crew, right? So what MAC Cosmetics did, they released five different variations of the iconic Ruby Woo lipstick. You know the Ruby Woo is in a tube formula. It's matte. It doesn't move all day long. But MAC released um, this one that I love, the Powder Kiss. Um, liquid lipstick. If you've ever tried MAC's Powder Kiss formula, you know that it's soft. It's like a velvet soft finish, so it's like a soft matte cream. But they released it in a liquid form, and this has made me fall in love again with Ruby Woo. Because while I've always liked the color of Ruby Woo, I mean, who does not like that color? It looks amazing on everybody, and that ain't even no cap. It looks amazing on everyone. But for me, the formula formula to put it on was just so drying and I felt like I had to do a lot of work but when they released this one and this one is called Ruby's Boo it's called Ruby Boo but it's Ruby Woo in a powder kiss formula right when they released this one this fall I went and got it immediately and I have been wearing this one faithfully you can see it on my Instagram it made me fall in love again with Ruby Woo. So if you like a little softer finish, you love the color Ruby Woo, but you like a little softer finish of a soft liquid matte lipstick that doesn't feel so drying, I would suggest getting the Powder Kiss formula of Ruby Woo. And this is in the color Ruby Boo. This was not a limited collection. This is something that MAC is keeping around. And I believe I got this at Belk. The department store but it was $27 this is what it looks like it has a real nice applicator on it but this is Ruby Woo in a powder kiss formula this is my number five red lipstick next up is another one this is somewhat new to my stash I actually got this one last month but I have to say that I have been loving the NYX um, lingerie lip the XXL liquid lipsticks because to me they are so soft to me they're like one step above the soft matte creams these dry down to a soft uh, to a matte finish but they don't feel like it and this is in the shade this is the NYX lingerie XXL and this is in the straight stamina and it's a nice sexy vixen red okay and look at this doe foot applicator it is so easy to apply 
it is a very very pretty red and y'all it is only eight dollars super super easy on your pockets these last for so long nyx really 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 did a good job with these xxl i think they have like 30 colors of these but of course when i went to look for one the first one i grabbed was a red this is fairly new to my stash but i have been wearing this one and what i like about this one too and wearing it is because um it lasts if i'm out wearing a mask and i have my mask on obviously i do but when i'm out and i want to wear a lipstick i put this one in my purse because when i take my mask off it's not smearing especially when i wear it with a lip liner it's not smearing at all it's not all over the place it doesn't dry out my lips but it lasts all day number four nyx xxl lingerie xxl in the shade stamina that's number four Number three, one that is precious to me. Um, I have really come to love Minta Cosmetics over these last couple of years. You have seen it on my channel so many times. You know I go up hard for Minta Cosmetics. I really love them. I love their soft or their semi matte lipsticks and they have a whole red line, right? So number three on my list is from Minta Cosmetics. This is in a two formula and this is in the shade Red Car Wait. Yeah, red carpet red is the color. I hope you can see that. It's red carpet red. These run $18, I think, on Minta Cosmetics. Don't quote me, but you know I'm going to link it down below. This is a really pretty classic kind of red. And you know, Minta Cosmetics story, they made their cosmetics for black women, women with pigment, melanated women, whatever you want to call it, for black women in mind because they couldn't find new lipsticks that look good on brown skin. So they made a whole cosmetics line out of it. This red lipstick to me is no different. As you can see, it is a very pretty, almost a brick red color. Very, very pretty, very, very classic. It is a semi-matte, but it doesn't feel like it. It feels so good going on. And I'm going to show you a little swatch. This is a beautiful, beautiful classic red. And I know this would look so good on some brown skin. I absolutely love this color. It is so freaking pretty. And again, for me... Even if it's a pretty red, it has to wear well for me. And this one from Minted wears so good. So try this one too. Minted Cosmetics. This is in the shade Red Carpet. This is one of their semi-matte red lipsticks. Yeah, this is a great one. Number three. <laughs> Number two. This is not a new one at all. None of these are really new on the market at all. I think it's... Just, I dropped that. Don't pay attention to that. Except for this Ruby Boo. But number three, number two, number two, right? Number two is also from a black-owned makeup company from Colored Rain. This is Cherry Blossom. This is the Holy Grail Liquid Red Lipstick. I say it and I mean this. I'm not blowing smoke. Y'all know I don't blow smoke. I have never seen anybody wearing cherry blossom where it did not look amazing on them. Whether they were my skin tone, lighter, darker, in between. I have never seen anybody wear cherry blossom where it just did not look good. It is a fantastic liquid lipstick. It lasts all day long. This is another good one to wear under your mask. Once it dries down to that matte it's not budging at all and it has a very this is my second tube actually <laughs> it has a very nice applicator on it it is a liquid lipstick again cherry blossom from color rain i'm pretty sure this made the first cut of the first video back in 2019 i'm gonna have to go back and watch it but i'm pretty sure because this is making all of the lists and on top of that it's only about i want to say I keep saying 11 but that might be with the sale for the holidays. It's no more than $20, okay? It's like $15 to $17, super duper affordable. Of course, I have the link down below. I, honestly, if you're looking for a universally flattering red of a liquid lipstick, Colored Rain Cherry Blossom should be in your stash. It should be in your stash. I ain't saying, but I'm just saying Okay, you know I'm not going to steer you wrong. Number two, Colored Rain Cherry Blossom. Now, to my number one, it has been my number one red lipstick. It's been my GOAT, my personal GOAT for as long as I've been wearing red lipstick. When I found this lipstick, I said this is the lipstick for me. I don't have to search anymore. If I never wore another red lipstick, 
I would always come back to Maybelline Red Revival. Let me explain. This lipstick is $5.59 at Target. No more than $7 anywhere you shop. When I got this lipstick, and you can tell this is my like fourth tube of this. I have been wearing this lipstick. Like this is one that goes in my purse and one I keep on my vanity. It's that serious. To me, this is a perfect red. It is a cream finish. It's one of Maybelline's satin lipsticks. It's a cream finish paired with a lip liner. You'll get some last longevity out of it for sure. I wear this around the house. I wear this to go to the store. I wear this to go down to the mailbox, honey. That's how much I love this Red Revival from Maybelline. It is like the perfect juke joint, old school kind of red lipstick. You feel me? It's just that kind of red. It is also very universally flattering. It's, it doesn't have any orange in it. It has more blue in it than anything. So it's very, very flattering on everyone. It looks a little cherry, but when you put it on, baby, it is just popping. If, if you got to bury me in lipstick, bury me in Maybelline Red Revival. I'm so serious. <laughs> this is the lipstick that if they ask me what I'm taking on the space shuttle with me or what I'm putting in the time capsule with me, it would be this one. $5 from the drugstore. For a while, Maybelline wasn't making it for some reason. And then last summer, I found it in Target again because you had to like buy it on Amazon or Maybelline was like, try this one. And I was like, girl, no, I need Red Revival. I don't know what this other stuff is. It's cute, but it's not my Red Revival. All of a sudden, I seen it in Target. I got all three tubes. Target had three tubes in stock. I got all three. Because I didn't want to risk it again. That's how great, to me, this lipstick is. This is my favorite red lipstick. Red Revival from Maybelline. Inexpensive. Beautiful color. Looks amazing on brown girls. Just... Honestly, if you try it, let me know. I want to see a picture of you in my favorite red lipstick, okay? <laughs> so, out of all of the lipsticks that I own, y'all know how I feel about red lipstick. Like I said, those are my top five. I think if you're going to your family house, out to dinner, or something like that, you can get a really good red lip from those selections. But I want to know, what is your ride or die red lipstick? And if you don't have a favorite red lipstick, or if you tell me, I don't, I don't like red lipstick, I don't wear it because I can't find one that doesn't look good on me, red lipstick, I'm going to prove you wrong. I'm going to find you a red lipstick. Comment below, because I really want to know. I really want to know what is your ride or die red lipstick. I really feel like you, if you wear makeup... You need to have one signature red. Because red lipstick, it goes with everything. You can do an absolute glam face. You can put on a red lipstick and a mascara and go on about your day. Nothing else. But it just pulls you together. Pulls your look together. It gives you an instant classic feel. It just makes you feel good and you look amazing brown girls black women we look amazing in red lipsticks and they have come such a long way where you know I, i'm old enough to know when drugstore mascara was like frosted eyeshadow and an orangish red lipstick or a pink one that doesn't look good on any of us <laughs> But now, red lipstick has come so far. There are so many varieties and so many shades and so many price points. Even if you are like a high-end girl, there's a red lipstick for you. If you are a drugstore girl like me, there is a red lipstick out there for you. So I want to know, what is your ride or die red lipstick? Leave me a comment below. Let me know which one you're going to be rocking for the holidays. That's it, you guys. This was short and sweet to the point. My five red lipsticks for 2021. Because you know I did one back in 2019. <laughs> Things done changed, but they ain't changed that much. So leave me a comment below. If you're new here, hello and welcome to my new subscribers. I see y'all. Thank you for joining me on this vlogmas journey we're gonna keep this thing rolling okay so i will see y'all again very very soon bye guys